So I've been super busy working two jobs back to back. I have very little time to pay any attention to my aquariums. So I've just been feeding them, popping off the water and the filter. I haven't even bothered to change that because it's doing its job pretty good as it is. And today I took the time to have a look. And underneath the skull, I've discovered they've had babies and they've grown big enough to survive. So the mother's done, mother and father or whatever has done enough to uh, take care of them that they didn't get eaten. And one of them is actually an albino one, if you can see him there. He's about a half an inch long now. And the other ones have got stripes on them already. I don't know if you can see them in there. They look a little bit smaller, so it could be a couple of different uh, sets of them. Now, I don't want to disturb them, and I've been keeping the light off for the most part, so that's maybe why they got protected. Maybe they can't see them too well. But anyway, it's pretty interesting. Even in a tank full of a whole bunch of other fish, um, you can just leave them alone and they protect themselves. It's awesome. I, I don't want to lift that up to show too much. You can see the little babies there. I don't want to disturb them because it, they might get eaten. But those are the parents and they seem to be doing an awesome job protecting them. That one there is the biggest one of the group, so that's probably why they're getting protected so well. He's too tough for anybody to take on. Pretty cool. And an albino as well, which is really cool. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll give you an update if this happens again. And I'll give you an update later on on how big these guys grow and see if they actually survive the full length of it. They've come this far so far, so they probably will. Thanks for watching.